Well, hello, folks off YouTube. My name's Ian. Ladies and gents, what a fine evening. So, tiny, tiny little update. Because I know you want to know these things. Let's get straight into it. Straight into it. A uh, couple of days' time. Tomorrow, I've got to uh, have the car ready to go to the wedding inn. Very rarely have the uh, the seats up, so I've got to do that tonight. Got the Henry Hoover out. I'm going to clean the inside of the car. Probably take it to the car wash tomorrow. Give it a wax. Give it a bit of a polish. You know what I mean? <sighs> well, first and quite unexpectedly, today I got a lot of fire extinguishers, and unusually, they're all aluminium. So that's a big plus. So I've got to get all those out of the car, hoover up, seats back up, clean all the leather interior, etc. Et probably yeah, um, 15 fire extinguishers delivered. One of those, seven, so nearly half, are aluminium. So I don't know if there's been a little uh, discussion has altered these mindset. It keeps up like that, then we'll keep on doing them. Right. Uh, Houston, we have a problem. And the problem is, not where that lot's gonna go, because you know I've been making space, but where... That's gonna go. So the kind people at Evolution have sent me a power tool for review. As you can see, it's a big one, but it must be the day for reviews because I've also got another product for review and indeed I've received another gift as well. So, what is the problem? Where's it gonna go? Hi. It is a big box. It is a big box indeed. Will we be able to fit it in somewhere? Uh, yeah, it's not as though we'll be walking up and down here the next few days, will it? Because, well, I've been banned from scrapping. <sighs> oh, what do you mean banned from scrapping? Well, my beloved in the house said, you're banned. You cannot scrap for the week before the wedding. In case you cut something off you know or you go to the wedding with an eye patch on or things missing i mean there's a scar there that's just about healing so i did that two weeks ago and on that hand stabbed myself with a screwdriver and i only stabbed myself with a screwdriver because when i was using the cordless driver it slipped and it went in between my two fingers, so that caused a bit of a gouge there. So I put that down and I got the screwdriver and that slipped and stuck in my finger and stuck in my hand. So that's healing. So I can show you that. So that that's healing there. Look at the scars there. And it was in between my two fingers there. And that bit's healing nicely. And come to think of it, I think the one on my legs healed up as well. So I'm banned. Well, I've do something. Well, I did film a few more hours over the uh, last three weeks, which I haven't shown you. So if I get a chance, I might put a little bit of that together. Got to do summer in the evenings. I could always, I could always sit and talk to the wife. That would be novel, wouldn't it? Right, I've got to clear that car. See where we get on. Oh, looks like we've got a gorgeous sunset. I don't know if it's showing off those red hues there, but uh, we've been inside and we've borrowed some of the wife's polish. And I think it's time to uh, get, get some of the inside polished up. Ah. What the hell? I think it's his birthday. 
Right. Polish. I wasn't sure it so well, but I did even manage to cut myself uh, hoovering the car. I don't know how. Right, onwards. Oh, well, I've got to tell you, it's looking pretty tidy and clean in there. Uh, I see it's getting late now. The one thing I've got to do besides an exterior clean, go through the car wash tomorrow, is to do the insides here with it with a rag. Not too, too bad for guys to get in with trousers on, but for ladies wearing dresses, they get in and the dress brushes against this lot. So pretty important that uh, that lot is clean tomorrow. Well, we can see it's uh, ooh, getting dark now, but uh, four I pack it. What time is it? 9 p. 9 p.m. So uh, I think we'll just open this black package we've got. Shift all that up. Put that great big box in there. Call it a night. I'm looking forward to that after the wedding. Anyway, we've got this purple. I'm going to say it's some sort of clothing. Uh, cover up the addresses, it's to me. Fortunately, it says Bill, the sender, not the recipient. That would be upsetting. Uh, little sharp knife. Let's get in it. Okay, well, we've done a slit at the end. We haven't looked inside. That comes no. <laughs> oh, well, just look at this. <laughs> I just don't just remember. Really <laughs> so forgive the laughter. I'm not even turned it over. It looks like a pillow. Okay. <laughs> Whereas I look at the uh, this lot, and there is no, no nothing, no writing. There's nothing that says anything. I spotted that logo. Ah, come on. Focus. If you don't know what that logo is, that is e waste Mike. So he has sent me a <laughs> pillow. One moment. Right, well, as a lot of folk know, I once cut myself on a pillow. I just don't ask. Well, if you do want to ask, you need to ask uh, Ralph Murek, because I did it on a live stream. And, uh, no, no. Just don't go there. So if I'm going to turn, touch this pillow, I need to put some safety gloves on. Right. That's, that should protect myself, shouldn't it? Just risk one hand. <laughs> ah. Oh, look at that. e waste Mike has sent me a pillow. Right, oh, Ralph Murek. Oh, you're not the only one who can put his head on uh, e-waste, Mike, and go to sleep. No, 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 let's not go there. Oh, Mike, thank you for <laughs> You spoiled me. First, I get a, a very nice mug, and now I get my own genuine e-waste, Mike, pillow. Do you, know what I, do, you know, do you know what I need to do? I need to send Mike one of these, don't I? One of these. <laughs> Small. <laughs> Small e-waste. E-waste Ian. Ian Matthews YouTube stickers. Look at the size of them. Mike, you're awesome. Thank you very much. That, that has cheered me up no end. Uh... And believe it or not, the colour scheme will uh, go nicely inside. If the wife doesn't get hold of it and sling it outside. 
I'll let you know. Right, Ian, still got a boatload to do. It's going dark. Hope you've enjoyed this video. Hope it gave you a little bit of enjoyment. Uh, I'll go in and lick my wounds and uh, see you at the wedding. Well, it took some doing. And as you can tell, it's now gone dark. But we did get that great big box in there. Just leaves a tiny, tiny gap. Which is not quite as wide as me to get through. Uh. <laughs>